New season, new dawn for Eastbourne Borough under Lee Bradbury's management. Strictly speaking, it's a Priory Lane sunset like a gleaming Michelangelo canvas as the Sports and Tunbridge Angels take the field for this fixture in National League South. And the Angels looking to produce something promising from this right wing move. Blocked and the first corner of the game. Toby hooks it, but actually to a blue player and a decent strike from 25 yards. And Toby, a quick ball up that line and a decent break here on Elliot Romain. Neatly kept in, neatly laid off indeed by Lua to Wheeler. Lovely ball down that left-hand channel. Lua looks up, picks out his man. Oh, but he's only picked out a blue shirt. Desperation clearance. Wheeler keeps the pressure on, into the area. Tries the shot, squeezes it under the keeper. Well, Temple Angels won't be very happy about that, but Eastbourne Borough will be absolutely delighted. Wheeler cutting in from the left-hand side. Not much to shoot at, but he cracks his shot under goalkeeper Miles Roberts, and it's 1 0 to Eastbourne Borough. Unconvincing from Hadler, and the free kick given. Lower is away. Has Romain outside him on the left. He's going route one at the moment. Now he finds Romain. Romain, one touch, looks up. Over it goes. Blue head. Lua right down by the far corner flag. Needs to find a red shirt. Plays it infield. Oh, well, there was a shout for a penalty there. I've, uh, a shot comes in from... Torres in the meantime. Well, still in play. Oh my goodness, there's a yellow card surely for this one. Early ball forward. Oh, almost splits the defence. Oh, horrible challenge here. And this really cannot go on. And he has the nerve to answer back. Here's Lua, high and not very handsome. Wills, ball through, and a finish, Greg Lua timed it perfectly, beats the keeper, seconds before the 45 minutes are up, and Eastbourne Borough have doubled their lead, it's Eastbourne Borough 2, Tunbridge Angels 0. First there, quicker there, and Hadler smacks it forward. Greg Lewis fancies the chase, he's in behind the centre-back, plays it across, keeper is there. And splayed out there to the left-hand side, just kept in. Here's the cross, massive cross, beyond the back post. Well, Wills was lurking, but the blue head gets it clear. Free kick from halfway. Diagonal to the left-hand side. In behind. Oh, just needed to find a red shirt. Followed up, though. And the shot is well wide. Run out of space there, though. And a foul given by the assistant referee. Kieran has Toby available. Finds Westy, and here's Toby now. It's his wrong foot for the shot. He needs to offload. He does so. All a bit tight. Here's the chance at the shot. Low keeper controls it. Still goes free. West finds Toby, and he takes too long, and it's blocked. Borough still with the pressure on. Kane Wills picks it up. Towards the near post, and it's come off the, the blue player. Right? There could be a break on here for the Kent side. Offside, not given. Racing through, edge of the area, could be a finish. Just wide. 
useful ball up the line by Toby to Kane Wells. Racing ahead of him is Greg Lua. Plays it instead into the edge of the box. It's there for Elliot if he can get there. Headed back to the keeper, right in front of Elliot Romain, but they get away with it. Other by a rolling to give him his full name. Takes his team player on. Cross it goes. There's a header. Oh, nearly falls for Elliot Romain. Just a bit of a blue block on it. Excellently followed up by West, and he picks up the return ball from Lua. Drills it in. All the way across. Just can't get a red touch. Another by a rolling can try again. West. Same again. A higher ball this time. Headed clear. Useful passing by the Angels. Can they get through the barriers? They're going round them. Looping cross. Well defended. Good break down the right. Drilling shot. Only a goal kick. In goes Walker. Oh, keeper's just there ahead of him. Big diagonal ball. Better by a rolling is there, and he'll win this one. Needs a decent delivery, but finds Walker. The header is high by Derry, but he keeps possession. And another great big ball towards the back. Only finds Tom Hadler. A very important header there. It's at the expense of a corner, but uh, it might just have saved a goal because had that header not deflected it, then Elliot Romain was in on goal. a decent ball. Jared Small is on it with a bit of space. Hoaks it in. Just right across the goal, that header. Oh, excellent uh, retrieval there. The man can't quite get past his man. In comes Toby. Across it goes. Oh, and it's a corner. What will he do with this corner? That's better. Header down, wide of the left post. Walker is underneath it. Needs good tight control. Finds Ferry. Little ball in. Great, great into passing and in fairness a very fine save. Here's Ferry. Shot is on. Now the shot is on. Oh, and it whizzes just over. Attacking the area. Shot is on. Angels with yet another cross. And that one's fallen, almost fallen. It's Tunbridge who come away again. In this rather curious, rather patchy second half. Yet another cross. Mr. Skipper says that will do. The two goals will certainly do for East Bourneborough. They've produced the first win of the season. Three points, very welcome after that really, really tight defeat at Billericay. And the manager, I'm sure, will be happy with what he's seen this evening. And onward he goes to another home fixture on Saturday against Oxford City. It's building time for the borough, and the building this evening has been pretty pleasing overall. It's finished, East Bourneborough 2, Tunbridge Angels 0. Well, Lee. Uh, useful result. Are you more happy with the result or the performance? Both, to be honest. I mean, the most important thing's the win, but I think the togetherness that the team shown over the last two games um, has been there for everyone to see. I think a ve very new group as far as a lot of them have played the level, as I said, Saturday, but not together. And um, they seem to be going, going to war for each other, which is great. You know, we work very hard for one another. Um, and you have to at this level, because if you don't, as soon as you take your foot off the pedal, you'll get beat. So, um, yeah, we're at this moment in time, very pleased with how things are going. Because uh, with the greatest respect to them, Tunbridge Angels aren't probably the best football inside in the division, but you've still got a cliche beat what's in front of you, haven't you? And of course. You've still got to break them down. You've still got, you know, they try and outwork you and they, they do work hard as a team. 
Um, I said to the players before the game, if, if we manage to match their work rate, then I think we've got the quality to get, get the opportunities to, to win the game, which is exactly what happened. A good first goal, Nicky Wheeler coming into the team. Um, wriggled along the line and, and scored, and, and the second goal was a, a great ball from Kane and a fantastic run and finish from Greg Lua. You know we had lots of opportunities tonight, and two 0 is um, it's a good win, but you know we we could have won four 0 tonight. Um, tell us about the substitutions. Was that about game time? Was it about wanting to try to back four instead of five? Or yeah, uh, Kieran's had a um, knock recently, um, so is Serge. His back's tight, um, and. Yeah, the other one really, Michael West was just a, so we're a bit, uh, bit more fluid in midfield. We're not a two and a one exactly. Um, we we could sort of flip it between a holding midfielder and two attackers and the other way around. So mm. because uh, the way Westy can sort of slip into a ten or, or an eight if you like. So um, yeah, we managed to keep them at bay and uh, keep a clean sheet. Thankfully, um, the boy just headed it past the post with five minutes to go. Otherwise, it would, could have been a different yes, end. Yes, indeed, yes. Um, so the difference between the mood at the end of the game in the Bill Billericay, in your dressing room at Billericay yeah. and, and tonight, big well, difference. Yeah, well, the, the difference is we, we took the chances, or, or some of them, and um, we managed to get that win on the board today. Um, and it, it's good because we've got our first win. Um, now we can, um, we can move on and try and and go on to uh, Saturday's game, Oxford City. You know, we want, we want a good crowd here to come and get behind us. You know, I thought the crowd were great tonight. Um, good crowd here, but we need to get them up if we can. So the people need to bring family, friends, whoever it may be, come and get behind East Bomborough and uh, hopefully see us win Saturday. You heard the gaffer. We'll see you on Saturday.